Bloomberg Audio Studios. Podcasts, radio, news. A single best idea, a quick one today. Busy, busy day. I'll be with Bob Michael of J.P. Morgan at a wonderful Bloomberg conference this afternoon. Really looking forward to that. It's made easier because Michael's been so right about yields coming in. I released today my chart of the year for 2024. It's out on Twitter, on LinkedIn. i got to figure out how to make it prettier. But there it is, and it's what I least expected last year. I did not participate, full disclosure, in a bond bull market. We came from a crushing negative six standard deviations. That's a medical chart, folks, a carnage in the bond market. Negative six standard deviations in the Bloomberg corporate series, total return series. And we've come up not quite halfway back to the nirvana of the great moderation. I did not see this coming. It is my chart of the year. Look for that. And I'll do it, you know, more here through November and into December uh, as well. We had a spectacular spectacular bond show today. We're going to focus on single best idea and what you're focused on, not McDonald's, not Boeing. Maybe earnings season in place, Microsoft the 30th, Apple on Halloween. Uh, you know, we'll have to see how technology does. But you got to be in the market to play. Who else to talk to? But Robert Dahl of Crossmark. It does not pay over the long term if you have no information to be out of stocks. Stocks beat most other major asset classes most of the time. That's the starting point. Then you can get more sophisticated after that. But look, we're always scared. Mar- market stocks in particular love to climb a wall of worry. Yes, we're worried about elections. Yes, we're worried about earnings. Yes, we're worried about evalu- valuations. We're worried about the Fed. All kinds of things, not to mention the geopolitical issues. Uh, but you've got to be invested if you're going to make those long-term returns notwithstanding that long-term comment that uh, Costin and I are making about uh, about valuation starting point. Bob Dahl, they're talking, and that question was off of the debate, off of Goldman Sachs, David Costin, uh, looking out 10 years for some mediocre returns. Dahl agrees with Costin. Edgar Denny writing a note last night, uh, really pushing against the Goldman Sachs thesis, looking for a roaring 2020s. And at the end of the note, he says, can he dare predict a roaring 2030s? We will get both Mr. Costin and Mr. Yardeni on surveillance as their schedules permit. Always a good day when Francis Donald darkens the door here at our world headquarters, 59th Street at Lexington Avenue. Francis Donald with RBC Capital Markets. All Paul wanted to do was talk to her about Montreal. I mean, she is a Canadian. And we covered that. Canadians... <clears throat> A rebuilding year. Here's Francis Donald on what you're worried about, the nation's debt and deficit. I can't believe we don't talk every single day about federal spending. It has been so extraordinarily disruptive to every single economic model that exists, and it has changed the way that we have to evaluate the cycle. But problematically, we see these deficits rise and spending increase, but net interest spending is now larger than defense spending. And if we're spending yep, yep. government money and it's going to pay treasury holders outside of the United States, that's not helping everyday Americans. Yep. It's not boosting Growth, and it's not actually inflationary either. So it isn't just about the amount of government spending, which is just chaotic in terms of how it's changing the way the economy operates. It's where it's going. And defense, net interest spending, uh, even entitlements is not going to be the juice that fuels this extended, continuous, resilient aggregate economy. Francis Donald, RBC. What are we doing here at Single Best Idea? Joe Weisenthal, Tracy Alloway. Out with a new restructured Odd Lots podcast. David Gura doing the Big Take podcast. These are longer, 10, 15, 20 minutes. Everybody's overwhelmed with 10, 15, 20 minute podcasts. Single best idea is a quickie. Three, four, five, top seven minutes with some of the best voices that we have. We hope you listen and please subscribe to it. Tell your friends about Single Best Idea. The podcast out on YouTube podcasts out on Apple Podcasts. This is Single Best Idea.